blush ballistic called Soot Ball. And um, I liked it. I liked the scent. Um, reminds me of, you know, the, the um, kind of old time uh, lush scents with, it was very earthy and um, thoroughly enjoyable. It had frankincense and sandalwood, which is one of my favorite things, and tonka bean, which is a kind of a vanilla -y scent, scented uh, bean. And uh, so it was kind of a deep, you know, kind of incense-y um, scent. And um, the only thing I have to complain about with the scent is that it's not strong enough. Um, I, you know, I love that combination. I just wish it were, you know, really strong so that I could uh, just enjoy that scent uh, all through the bath. So um, I wanted to put, make sure and record in there the, the cleanup involved with that ballistic. Um, because I know a lot of people on uh, both forums that were wondering, you know, what what it was going to be like. And I was kind of leery myself. I was like, you know, oh God, my, my skin's going to be black and my tub's going to be black and everything. But uh, it wasn't too bad. You know, my, my hands, when I was holding the soot ball uh, before I put it in, it, it did leave a black look like black soot on my on my hand um, but as far as the staining in the in the water in the tub you know it it really didn't as much as I thought it would I guess and uh, the color of the water is a really weird color it I mean it's kind of got that kind of weird odd spookiness about it um, I would call it like a goth kind of water in in the scent and the water you know what I mean it was just lovely um, it was kind of like, I guess the color of the water was sort of a, a greenish gray, like a, a black and green kind of uh, color. It wasn't black, you know, nor was it green. It was just kind of this murky, murky color. You can see the color in the video. And then within that water was this gorgeous undulating gold uh, just waving around in the water, cascading as you looked at it. It, it was just like alive with gold. So um, that part was really cool. And um, basically, you know, when I was done, 90% uh, of the of the black color uh, was actually purple. Um, when most of the water went away, and I noticed there was just specks of it, and it had turned purple. So. Um, just a little bit left over in the tub. The rest just rinsed away and I just took a Clorox wipe and just swiped those areas down and and it it was done. So, um, you know, uh, I like it. It was cute and uh, it's uh, the soot ball is uh, from a movie. Um, actually, I guess Lush Gorilla Perfume uh, team had hosted a scent Scent Cinema, Scented Cinema, um, and um, the director, he's a director, Hayao Miyazaki, um, he made a film called Spirited Away a few years back, and the ballistic was inspired by the soot gremlins, which are little creatures that dwell in the shadows of a house. And when crushed, they between the hands they dissolve into black soot. So they're soot gremlins, and um, just pretty cute. And of course, the, the black doesn't hold on. You know, there's it's not um, black through and through. It's bl black covering with a gold. Um, a, you know, mostly it's gold, and it has kind of. A, a little black kind of coating so um, you'll notice in the video where it kind of looks like a, a gold ball moving around in the water and so um, I like it I think people should try it it's uh, just really weird and odd and the smell like I say is is that yummy earthy incense smell that 
that I love. And so, okay, um, thanks for watching. And then I'll be doing my next video, which is going to be of the Lush Ballistic called M Lord of Misrule. And uh, it's the second ballistic that came out for Halloween. Um, and that just came to, you know, my order came to my house literally like a couple hours ago. So um, it, it came here really quick. All right. So I will see you on my next video. Okay. Bye-bye.